thinking about Elul, a bunch of questions have to come to mind. First of all, why is it that just by the month of Elul, we're so excited about the acronym of Aleph Lamed Vav Lamed? Ani Dodi Vidodi Li, Ishlu Eum Atanus Levyonim, Eslavav Chavi Eslavav. What is it about Elul that all of a sudden we're so excited? What about Cheshva and no one cares, Ches Shin Vav Nun, just Elul, Teves Kislev. So why only by Elul are we so excited about the acronym? Second of all, Elul is not even a Jewish word. We're making Rashi Tevos from a, it's a non-Jewish month. So what's the excitement about all these things and what does it have to do with the themes of Elul? So I think the answer comes from my namesake, Eliezer Ever Avram. That if you look through our Chomish and you look what Eliezer's life was about, everywhere it goes, it's Ever Avram Anochi. Who was Eliezer? Ever Avram. No matter where he goes, no matter what his business is, his first words, Evan Avram, Zani, this is who I am. When he's going to love him, when he's going to find, find Rip, everything. Zani. That, and every single thing he does begins with sort of that, that first step of, this is who I am and this is my mission. That is what it means to be an Evan. And the Avoda of El, the Avoda of Rosh Hashanah, Yom Narayim, is to become Ovde Hashem. To find ourselves in the kingdom of Hashem as His subjects, to be to be His uh, to be His servants, those who serve Him, and we need to look at the greatest servant ever, Eliezer, to to, to learn how to be in heaven, and that's why the avoda of El is to look where in life can I look? Every single place that I look at, no matter where it is, whether it's you know whether it's in the office, whether it's at home, whether it's in school, base matters even when you're learning Gemara, to say. Ever Avram Anochi, Ever Hashem Anochi. This is who I am. So we're always about how can I find Hashem in this avoda? How can I bring Hashem into this? You know, maybe it looks like Hashem's in here. No, I have to, this is who I am. I serve Hashem. He's got to be here. I got to find him and I got to bring him into this. And that's why Elo, which is the, the start of that avoda, to focus on it, we're looking at the first word. What, where are we? All we know is we're in the month of Elo. Bam! Elo, Anila Dodi. Let's focus on the most beautiful relationship ever. Just from the name itself. Let's find Hashem everywhere. Every letter. If you're a mamish and Ever Hashem, needs to be screaming out, Ever Hashem Anochi. And Nila Dodi, the Dodi Li, this is our relationship. And that's why everywhere you go, you have to like look around. Scream behind the trees. Look for Hashem. Look around on bricks. Wherever you can. You've got to find Him. This reminds me of one of my favorite stories. A child once asked his father, he said, Abba, how big is Hashem? And his father, he said, Hashem is as big as an airplane. And the child looks up at the sky, sees a tiny little airplane, and he says, wow, Hashem must be pretty small. And a little while later, the family is flying somewhere, and the child looks out of the uh, airport window, and he sees an enormous plane. And he says, wow, Hashem is so big. And he says to his father, I don't get it. Sometimes it looks tiny, sometimes it's big. I don't understand. How big is Hashem? So his father looks at him, and gently he says, the closer you are, the bigger he is, the bigger he seems. And that is exactly what we're talking about in the Avod of El. That when we fill up everywhere we look, we fill up our purview, our senses with Hashem. When behind every word we're seeing, oh, this must be Rashi Tevos, our love for Hashem. This is Rashi Tevos, our relationship with Him. We, we find Hashem here, we find Hashem there, and everywhere we look, it's Evan Hashem Anochi. I'm trying to figure out how to serve Hashem wherever I am. That is how we're Mamlech Hashem. And that is how we realize, because Hashem is the king anyways. He's the king of the whole world. It's all about us realizing that we are subjects, and that we are in His kingdom. And the more we bring Him in, the greater He will look in our eyes. Everything should be amazing. <laughs>